good morning come with me to classroom setup maybe day one it is currently 8 55 a.m hi my name is daisy welcome back to my channel and if you're new here i'm a kindergarten nope 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 no i'm not all right, y'all, this is what my classroom looks like right now. This is already all in here, and all of this is already all in here. And then here is all of my stuff that they brought over here. So I'm trying to move these to the literacy intervention room, but I moved three boxes and they're so heavy. So I'm going to put them on a rolling chair and then take them. So I took down like all those dirty boxes. They were super heavy. And I was gonna have the janitor like trolley them for me to the another room, but he was like on the other side of the school and it said wet wax. So I was like, I'm not crossing over there and I'm not waiting because by the time he like comes over here to his closet, I think I would be gone, which I don't mind, but that was kind of a lot of work. And I think I honestly could have dropped the box on myself because I'm kind of weak, as you can tell. This is like the same exact thing of my last room, except the different colors. And it's closer to the office. So I think I'm gonna put all my storage boxes right here, meanwhile, because my old closet was like organized to where I fit all of my boxes. This is my side. This is all already in here. So yeah, I'm gonna have to clean it out. So this is what I've moved so far, and this one also. I have all this stuff here left, I just moved the carpet. So this shelf was left in here, this desk was left by the last first grade teacher, and this shelf right here. Like I love these two, I don't know about that, but they need, both need a paint job, <laughs> and I don't really have time for that. But I think I'm going to lay out the table so I can start putting things on top of the tables and kind of like see. You know, it's almost 10.30 already and I feel like I've done nothing. I've been here for an hour and a half and I have an appointment at 1 in Northwest Arkansas, which is like an hour and 15 minutes away. It's at 1 o'clock and I'm leaving at 11. So, yeah, let's see what I get done in these 30 minutes. I just try to move this table, but I'm going to have all this stuff on that side now. So I put most of my stuff up there and then right here and in the hallway. What it looks like right now. I'm excited I'm excited about these tables because it fits up to six, even though I'm only going to have 25, so it's only at five at each table. But I feel like they're more spacious than the kindergarten square ones. So yeah. I'll keep you updated. Also, I'm really sad because in my old classroom I had the new smart board and now I have the old one again. Good morning! I'm going to the classroom today. Alright, so there's quite a few teachers here. So what I'm going to do is finish moving that over here so I can do the layout and let's go. So this is what I have right now. I have the tables like this. I'm planning to put my desk by the window, moving those two tables, but before I can do that, 
I have to move my fridge. That's super heavy. All right, y'all, this is what I have so far. This is super heavy, but I think I'm going to keep it. It was old teachers because I want to kind of hide all those wires behind that right there and like just keep my computer right there. I like where to sit at my desk, which last year I didn't really use my desk as a desk because yeah. Um, I would have like these tables right next to me. That's my small group kidney table in the middle. That one I'm going to put against the wall over there. And this is what it's- Yo, I can't even use this. Oh. I got it. I almost broke either my hips, my arms, my legs, or my wrists. I'm not sure. I think I might move these to that corner over there and then move the computer cart right here and so I think that'll work out better. That one won't be so tall either. So let's try. Alright. So I haven't pushed those against the wall because they're super heavy and I'm still going to paint them. But I ended up moving the other cabinet over there. I wanted both of them right here, but there's an outlet behind this. So I'm gonna just put the computer cart right here. That way I can plug it in and don't even have to worry about ever touching that outlet. Because if I were to have it over here, I would have to use the outlet that I'm using for literally everything. This is what it looks like. I'm about to go around and take off all those pink papers with my name on them. Because I'm tired of seeing them. There's so many. And they keep falling off anyway. Um, this is what it looks like. I like it so far. Alright you guys. I just went to go eat lunch in the cafeteria with another teacher. Because they have like the free lunch program going on. So that was some good lunch. I think I'm going to have some people come help me paint this stuff white. I think I'm just going for white and then decorate it after it's white or like get creative with it after it's white whenever I have time. But for now, since I already have this layout, I'm gonna start trying to get rid of some stuff that's over here. So I'm going to empty this out, clean it, and then organize my things. <laughs> So right now I'm sitting at my small group table and I just want to show you what it looks like from here. So I have one, two, three tables and two more tables on the outside and that's where my desk is at. And so far I think I'm liking this layout better than my old layout just because everything like at my desk, if it were to be on my desk when the students were here, which I didn't do that last year, um, when they were in here, then I would still be able to see them. And then I like the small group table in the middle. That way I'm not too far away from this side or this side. So there's a mess. But I felt like I was too far away from the students on the opposite side. So I'm just gonna sort them. These are just extra subjects from last year. I have been sorting these books and throwing things away in this rolly chair like so much stuff there was like diet coke can bottles from 
who knows when, they expired in 2018, but like a whole pack, I'm like gross. And the closet is a disaster, but my goal is to finish going through these books. Y'all, I am still looking through these books and throwing away trash, which kind of stinks that it's taking me so long, but there's so much stuff in here. But I finally have my car back. We are going to the classroom and I'm going to just clean and hopefully finish cleaning in like two hours. My goal yesterday, the reason it took so long is because I had to take a lot of trips to take everything to the recycling bin. But today I'm taking big black trash bags, just filling them all up and then throwing them all at once. Hopefully I get done with cleaning and upload basically my first setup vlog, which is just gonna be me cleaning. But at least you'll get to see like a before and after or right now you'll already see like the first part of it and then the fun part decorating and organizing and my nephews and nieces are going to go help me paint some things that i don't like the color of so that'll be fun i went to go buy the paint yesterday after i got back on my car i just got white paint all right y'all i'm at school now can i show you where i brought up more <laughs> I got some paper towels, just one because I have some at home, I just forgot. Some black big trash bags, a Lysol spray, and then I have the other half of my bagel for when I get hungry again. My phone charger and my car keys. And that's it, so. So this is my second wagon filled and when I tell you this closet is gross, I mean like my speed gross, like that's a lot.